हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू स्मार्ट टैक होप यू आर डूइंग वेल गाइस एज यूजुअल टुडे आई केम अगेन विद वन मोर वीडियो इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट अबाउट वन एप्सन डॉट मैट्रिक्स प्रिंटर वी हैव राइट नाउ विद मी एप्सन एल क्यू सिक्स नाइन जीरो डॉट मैट्रिक्स प्रिंटर एंड द इशू इज़ विद दैट प्रिंटर इट्स कंटिन्यूसली शोइंग पेपर आउट एर ओके टुडे आई विल टेल यू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल डाइग्नोस इट वट इज़ अ प्रॉब्लम even i don't know what is the exact problem is now i will diagnose it and will show you some key steps to do this and which parts you have to check uh, step wise to diagnose this problem and then we will fix it as well so stay with me uh, and watch the complete video if you want to really uh, learn how to fix epson dot matrix uh, this is actually a dot matrix printer uh, for printing devices uh, many companies are using this printer very useful and little costly as well uh so guys uh, stay tuned uh, watch the complete video and now i will rotate my camera uh, to show you uh, how to open this printer which part we have to check first and then second and third okay guys uh, like i'm now rotating the camera hold on this yes, guys this is the model number LQ690 Epson brand you can see in front of you uh guys this is the head of the printer and here become we can fix the ribbon of the printer ribbon came here okay so uh, there are some things i will tell you what to check okay uh, i will uh, uh, we will open this first uh, now just first of all i will show you what is the problem if i turn it on okay, you can see it started okay as you can see right after the startup it showed the error paper out there is no jam sometimes it come with the jam because there is a sensor here but there is no jam inside i already checked so we have to open this printer first okay then we will check uh, uh, why this error is coming uh, guys uh, i want to bring in you to your notice there are three things um, for this paper out error one is you can see this is sensor this is paper sensor sometime this sensor become damaged must be to replace okay we will check this also uh, second thing there is gears inside plastic gear you cannot uh, see until i open this here is gear sometime the gear is broken plastic gear uh, the third thing is the main board data board so now first of all we will open this uh, the first thing we will check the gear Okay, if the gear is fine, then we'll ch then we will check the sensor. Gear and sensor both uh, are fine. Then we will check the motherboard. Okay, so now uh, I will tell you how to open this. There are four screws actually. One screw is here, one screw is here, and three screws are here. Okay, we will unplug this, and we will open the screws. And there is one lock also. Don't forget. so uh, let me open this and then i will tell you about the gear guys i open the screws the five screws we open okay so now we will uh, open this cover there is a lock here uh, you can see okay yes. yes guys i open the cover and the gear i was telling you is right down the here so i will open this i will open this plastic cover uh so tell you how to open this to open this plastic cover guys uh remove this cable from here okay from the cable okay now uh, the wires are coming from right here we will no no this also one small wire for sensor okay now two wires inside two wires inside here we will release from here i need screw driver hold on this i i release this cables from here then now this is little loose we will push it pull out this is moved and 
cable left this also we will remove this plastic okay guys this is removed this is was the gear guys I was talking about yes guys with the help of flat screwdriver we will unlock this lock okay so uh, pull little up I need my both hands to unlock this we will check the gear is fine or not. You will see. Lock is. Now I will remove the gear. Yes, guys. As you can see, the gear is broken from this side. Yes, guys. You can see in mobile screen, the from this side, this gear is broken. So now I will replace another gear. I have one gear. You can see, I have one used gear, uh, but this is fine, not broken. Uh, you can find it uh, in the local market, or you can buy online from AliExpress or eBay. You can find there. And the price is, uh, I think, for one gear is two or three dollars. Okay, so I have the new one also and the used one as well. So I will fix this, the old one, and we will check the error uh, after replace the gear we will see if there is an error or not and I am hopefully 99% that after replace this air uh, there will be no more error okay guys uh, I will fix back this lock you can see with the help of long nose okay now I will connect the power then we will see is there error or not okay, I will connect the power this guy connected the power cord I will turn it on let's see yes uh, here we go guys you can see there is no error now before you can you see before when I turned the power on there was an error continuously right after the boot up now there is no error if I will press this so no paper okay now there is no paper so that's why this is uh, so you can see the printer is now ready state uh, if you want me to print any document uh, I will print and will show you hold on just I uh, feed the paper then we will give the paper print command uh, guys uh, all of you you know that uh, this is uh, the option for uh, type of paper which type we want to insert so I have a4 paper normal plain paper I will uh, turn it back here because now the printer will feed this paper a4 yes. we will give the print command now from here Yes, you can see. Okay, guys, there is no error and it's printing fine. Uh, you can see there is no ribbon inside, so that's why you cannot see anything on the paper. Okay, guys, uh, there is no no ribbon inside, so that's why there is no text because there is no ribbon. Uh, the printer is working fine. Now the problem was in the gear. Uh, in case if you found that uh, the, the gear is fine and the sensor is fine also then the other step sometimes uh, I will show you the board this is the data board actually uh, the, the, the resistance here there are resistance uh, this is the resistance and also this is and this is are the like bridges functions sometimes this become out of order uh, became damaged so most probably if you found that uh, gear is fine 
sensor is fine so you have to replace this motherboard this is data board okay guys so now we will uh, assemble back our printer now we will fix back this um, we fix back this cover and we will turn everything back hope you understand the method it's very easy if you found any difficulty you can ask me in the comments i will reply your queries so uh, let me say goodbye guys uh, don't forget to subscribe the channel take care bye